now let us see uh, how to do divisions of decimal numbers so same concept will apply in the multiplications even decimals also we have in three types first one a uh, division by 10 100 thousand so on any decimal number is given dividing with 10 hundred thousand so on okay let us take one example uh, 623 point let us take 4 to divide by 10 okay to find this answer when your multiplication point should shift to right side right when you are doing division that point that means we are shifting the decimal point one is to the left because there is a one zero as many zeros that many places left side you have to shift that means answer is six two three four two so this decimal place shifted to the uh, left side so sixty two point three four two divided by ten see one more example same number six twenty three point four two if it is divided by one hundred uh, so in this case this decimal place shift to two places because of uh, division with 100 so that is 6.2342 okay. n number of zeros that many places is point should shift to back so left side okay see another example let us take easy one okay 2.3 and divide by let us take uh, 1000 in that case Without decimal, this number is 23. Now, this place should shift to left side three places. Up there is only one. But more, no more two places. So, you can keep in mind another two zeros. So, extra two zeros if we keep. So, this should shift to here. So, 0 0.0023. Because up here is one and two. Then three. Because of uh, three zeros. 0 0.0023 right this is the division when 10 hundred thousand so on same way uh, one more is a division by whole number uh, let us take one example dividing the whole number 16.952 divided by let us take 8 8 is a whole number <coughs> now do division this normal division you can do without considering the point let us take keep the point but normal uh, we will do division same way we will do this uh, keep 8 same 8 table so 8 to the 16 right 0 now when you take the decimal when you take the number after the point you also keep the point here there is only a change right divide the normal manner Ignoring the decimal and mark the decimal point in the quotient when just crossing over the decimal point in the dividend. When you cross this, keep the point here. 9 it is. So 8 times 1 is 8. 1, 5, right? Same. 8 times 1 is 8. Subtract 7. Next place is the 2. So 8, 9, so 72. Zero. Only thing is when you take the dis when you take the digits after the point, keep the point here also in the quotient place. Right? Any example. Let us see one more example. Okay, if it is a 0 0.945 uh, divided by 9. So what we should take here is a 0, it is. So 9 0 is a 0, right? But when you are taking this after the point 9, so immediately you have to keep the 0. So 9 times 1 is 9. So 0 point. Next uh, 4, 5. 4 is only one digit. Take one more digit and put point. 9, 5 is a 45. Normal divisions only, but when you are taking the digit after the point, you also keep the point in the quotient. Okay, this is the uh, one. And one more case. When it is a decimal, divided by decimal number. Okay, division of decimal number by another decimal number. Okay, let us see one example. 4.8 divided by 0 0.8. That means 4.8 by 
0 0.8. So in this case, at least a denominator we should make it as a whole number. Denominator after the point is one decimal. And so we can multiply 10 by 10 because after the point is one decimal. 4.8 into 10 is 48. 0 0.8 into 10 is so 8. 48 divided by 8. So 6. 4.8 divided by 0 0.8 is 6 only. See one more example. Okay, for example, 5.625 divided by 1.25. So in this uh, div uh, dividend place, this numerator and denominator. Denominator we have two decimal places. 5.625 divided by 1.25. If you don't want to multiply with 10, 100 and so on, just a simple technique is this point you can shift to two decimal places, numerator and denominator. So value does not change. Now this becomes 562.5. This is 125. 5.625 becomes 562.5. 1.25 becomes 125. Value does not change. Do normal division now. Take 562.5 divide with 125 now. So it's simple. So 125 force of 500 625. So after the point I took again. After subtracting next digit I took. So you also keep the point. 125 times 5 is 625. So 0, 4.5. Just only denominator you can make it as a whole number and same logic you apply when division with whole numbers. Okay, this is the method you can follow when we uh, division of decimal numbers.